Hi, hello, my dear students. Welcome to our channel, Rajesh Biology and Rajesh Chemistry Biology. Today, our topic is a Botany Grand Test. So, before starting the session, let me check is our session is just started or not, and is our voice is clear or not first. Yes, the session is just started now. Yes. Good evening. I think the voice is also clear. Good evening, Chinu. Right. So without any late, let's dive into the session. We have a app that is available in Google Play Store. In this app, I provided so many materials that is uh, including the material for reading and for practice also lakhs of questions are there from all the subjects like mathematics, physics, chemistry and biology. Mathematics, physics, chemistry is for the JE mains. More than thousands of questions are there. And uh, for uh, PC, MBA, by PC students, uh, MSET and NEET aspirants, there is a NEET examination papers are there. More than lakhs of questions are there. And all are for the free only. And free tests, free courses are available. And few are paid courses. They are value for money. You never feel regret. Even though you pay some amount for that uh, courses. So now come to this. Here it is the first question from the botany. Consider the following statements about the pollen grains and choose the correct statements. You should choose the correct one. Yes. Very good. The right answer for the question one is option one only a b e are correct and come to the second question body of the body of the megasporangium fuses with the funicle in the region called yes very good chinnu first one is right answer come to the second question body of the megasporangium you just with the funicle in the region called. Right. So, yeah, Chandrika. Um, Chandrika says option one for the second question. Micropile. No, it is uh, not a micropile. It is actually the hilum. Option three, hilum. Yeah, Dharani, Dharani Ammu, welcome. Good evening. And Swarupa, welcome. Uh, good evening. And Gnaneshwari, very good. Come to the third question. Good evening, all of you. Yeah, Dharani, you are right. One is one and two is three. Chinnu, right. Gnaneshwari, right. Come to the third question. Yeah, so... Who Chandrika says support option, both A and B you are saying like the type of pollination which brings generic, genetically different types of pollen grains to the stigma. So let me check. Actually the genogamy only, only the genogamy. What happened to your preparation? No, it is genogamy. Come to the fourth question. Where it is, yes, auto rotation is time. Now come to the fourth question. There any right? Here it is the diagram. Yes, Ganeshwari, you are right. A thalamus, B seed, and D. This is endocarp and uh, C endocarp and D with the C endocarp and D mesocarp. Very good. Come to the fifth question. Yes, fourth one, three, right? Chinnu and Ganeshwari. Fifth question here. The common asexual reproductive structure in Pencilium are the common reproductive structure in Pencilium are. Yes, Swarupa. You are right. And Chandrika and Ganeshwari are also right. Conidia. 
everybody knows but swarupa please try to mention the question number also along with our answer because in every slide at least two questions are there and come to the sixth question the right answer is yeah chandrika you are right very good an organism showing dominant phenotype and whose genotype is to be determined is crossed with the recessive parent that is called test cross very good chandrika and ganeshwari dharani nice come to the question number 7 phenotypic and genotypic ratios are equal and same in case of phenotypic and genotypic ratios are equal and same in type of it is also very easy question very very easy question in which the both phenotypic and genotypic ratios are similar dominance is a 3 is to 1 phenotypic 1 is to 2 is to 1 genotypic co dominance we cannot say based on the uh, type of uh, cross we can say 1 is to 1 is to 1 is to 1 and the independent assortment co dominance you are saying no the right answer is actually the incomplete dominance both genotype and phenotype is 1 is to 2 is to 1 mirabilis chelapa 4 o'clock plant evening primrose that um, evening uh, plants like a uh, snapdragon flower okay yes very good chinu eighth question it is a it is a easiest question eg seventh question eighth question starch synthesis in pea seed is starch synthesis it is also easy question direct question from the ncrt starch synthesis in pea seed a direct question from the ncrt it is also eighth question and come to the ninth question identify the incorrectly matched pair so nobody says the answer for the question number eight actually it is incomplete dominance capillar capillar produce completely dominant uh, more amount of starch capillar smaller produce less amount of starch smaller smaller produce poor or there is no starch so it is incomplete dominance three different types of phenotypes are there very good Dharani and uh, come to the ninth question yes you are right Naneshwari human skin color is not a pleiotropy that is a polygenic inheritance rudimentary ovary turner syndrome point mutation sickle cell anemia sex linked rest color blindness correct come to the tenth question the correct sequence of taxonomical categories is class, phylum, order, family, genus, species or yeah, Chandrika ninth uh, is actually the one, option one. Yeah, Dharani correct, Chinnu right and ten three you are saying uh, Chinnu, check it once, phylum immediately after order or class, first phylum under phylum there is a classes after classes order order next family family genus species option two is the right answer yes chinnu right come to the 11th question in a polynucleotide chain 11th question in a polynucleotide chain a nitrogenous base is linked to the oh of first carbon pento sugar through n glycosidic linkage two nucleotides are linked through three five phosphodiester bond yeah, 11th question, Chinnu says third one, phosphate group linked to the OH of fifth carbon of the nucleoside through phosphodiester bond, nucleoside, okay, but actually the right answer is one, 11th one, one is the right answer, very good Chinnu, come to the 12th question, genetic information flows from DNA to RNA protein, this was proposed by, yes it is also very important and easy question, this is called a central dogma and central dogma is proposed by the James Watson or Francis Crick or uh, Nancy Wilkins or both uh, Watson and Crick. No, Watson and Crick is wrong. Only Crick proposed that uh, central dogma. Abhi, welcome Abhi, preparing Bhavandi, yes, what about you Abhi, how you prepare for the NEET examination, come to the 12th question, to come to the 13th question, 13th one is, 
only one strand of DNA is copied into RNA during transcription. Only one strand of DNA is copied into the RNA, RNA during transcription. Double stranded RNA prevent RNA from being translated into protein. Double stranded RNA prevent RNA from being translated into the protein. Yes, correct. That's why only one strand of DNA is copied into the RNA during transcription. So both are correct and it is the correct explanation for the assertion. 13th one. No, it is a correct. Uh, both are correct and correct explanation only. Come to the 14th question. Match the following DNA polymerase, RNA polymerase 3, RNA polymerase 1, splicing, RHO factor. RRNA, SNA RNA, Okazaki fragments, RNA polymerase, mRNA processing. Right. The 13th one is the one is right answer. Very good, um, Dharani. Sorry, the 14th one. 13th one is one. Okay, correct. Come to the 14th one. Aha, everybody says 14th one when I take it on the 14th question. You are not checking that uh, whether it is the right or wrong also. The right answer for the 14th one is 4. Come to the 15th question. Base sequence in a strand of mRNA is a uh, 5AUG, GAC, CUG, AUA, UUU, UGA3 end. Okay. This is the mRNA. What is the base sequence of DNA strand from which it has been transcribed? Can you write down uh, which type of uh, the strand, DNA strand sequence based on the mRNA? A U G the first one first quadrant is A U G so what it is uh, T A C correct and G A C C T G only G A C means C T G so first option is wrong 15th yes very good Chinnu you are right second one is the right answer come to the 16th question a new breed of sheep Hisardale developed in Punjab is produced by which breeding method? It is the every time we are asking the repetitive question. It is 16th question. Easy question. Hisardale is an example for which type of breeding? Cross, outbreeding, outcrossing, interspecific hybridization. And uh, 16th question. No, 15th too, right? Chinnu and Dharani. 16th question. Hisardale. Between the Yajnaneshwar, you are saying what? 16th. Is it not clear? If you click on the screen, there is a setting symbol. Go for the quality and click on 480 or 720. And the right answer for the 16th is crossbreeding. No, it is not 3. Crossbreeding it is. Example for the crossbreeding. Marino, Roms and Bikineri Eves. 16th. Very, very easy questions while you are uh, not giving the perfect answer. Yes, Dharani Chinnu, very good. And uh, after I'm giving the answer, you said very well. Come to the 17th question. Resistant to yellow mosaic virus and uh, powdery mildew, mildew in mung in mung bean is provided by which breeding method? Seventeenth question. Remember in final examination, neat examination, most of the questions, more than 80% of the questions are easy and direct lines from the NCRT. Okay. Don't think very deeply like uh, this much very easy question how they give so there is a trick so i think this uh, right answer is maybe the wrong like the don't think what you feel that is only the right answer attempt that with the right answer only don't think more deep okay so 
Yes, come to the seventeenth question. The right answer is only mutation breeding. Option three. And eighteenth question. The given diagram showing which of the following organism causing which disease. Adenovirus causes respiratory infections. Tobacco, tobacco mosaic virus causes mosaic disease. HIV causes AIDS. Streptococcus causes respiratory disease. TMV mosaic it is 18th one. Chandrika and Ganeshwari also says it is a TMV. I think TMV is not like this. Bacteriophage maybe that is uh, what I feel is. But come to here, it is adenovirus, which causes the respiratory disease. Very good, Chinu. Come to the nineteenth question. TMV, yes, there, there is like this type of structure is there maybe. Nineteenth question. Which of the following is wrong matching of microbe and its industrial producer? Microbe and its industrial producer. Nineteenth question. Yeast state statins, Aspergillus niger, citric acid, Trichoderma polysporum, Cyclosporin A, Clostridium, acetic acid. Nineteenth question. Yes, very good, Maneshwari. You are right. Clostridium acetic acid is the wrong match. Now come to the twentieth question. No chance. It is fourth option. Twentieth question. In a lake, there are forty lotus plants. It is very important from the organisms and population chapter, and uh, focus on that chapter. Organisms and population is a very important chapter for the NEET examination. In that, at least one or two questions they will ask in the final NEET. Focus on the population interactions and population growth. And population attributes, the factors, different forests are also their rainfall. Okay, the diagram is their precipitation, annual precipitation, annual temperature diagram. Okay, so like that, uh, it is very important uh, chapter. Come to the question number twenty. In a lake, there are forty lotus plants last year, and uh, through reproduction, twelve new lotus plants are added. Taking current population as fifty two, birth rate in the population is how much it is? Clear ga le do okay. The right answer is actually the zero point three percent. Tell me, do one thing. Just click on your screen. When you click on the screen in the middle, there is a pause button and uh, everything it will be appear on the right upper corner. There is a settings button. Click on the settings button. And the first option is the quality. Go for the quality and advanced. Seven twenty pixels you can select. Then it is be clear. Okay. Now come to the question number twenty one. Yes, Nyaneshwari, you are right. D N by D T is equal to R N into one minus N by K. Super. And in our app, Rajesh Biology, most of the questions uh, papers are there. Full test, grand test, chapter wise test. Like that, lakhs of questions are available from the all four subjects: physics, chemistry, botany, zoology. Full syllabus grant tests are there, and different reputed institutions and their papers, practice papers, everyday practice tests are there. So, if you prepare all these tests, uh, that is more than enough to get the NEET rank uh, within this few days also. So, try to complete most of the question papers before you attend the final examination. Come to the twenty-second question. If you are first-year student or second-year student, start practicing the question papers from now onwards only, based on your college track sheet. You can select the the one topic, and all are very important questions like this type of statement questions. Every time in a NEET examination from the last few years, from the recent years, the questions they are given to to consume our time, to waste our time, like statement type of questions or four statements they give, how many statements are correct, what are the statements are correct, assertion, reason. So all the questions are the statement type only. Yes, come to the question number twenty two. 
the right answer is uh, only statement 2 is correct 22 4 yeah tell me chinnu you put a chip on mtd 23 24 in our app i completed the target need short term batch both in english and telugu explanation it is in the low telugu explanation on to the running english terminology on to the so both english and telugu uh, terminology explanation the and in the book out three uh, three months lo complete chess in a course land in the the include animal tissues to at once at one animal tissue kingdom animalia human reproduction reproductive health genetics uh, up to the morgan experiment complete challenger in the the end low daily test some type and a pretty rojo of course to apply a class chapter on our class low on the previous questions in a discuss data discuss this in the animal someone in chief of a exam conduct chain of a lot daily test on type ఒక వారం అయిన తర్వాత క్యూమ్యులేటివ్ టెస్ట్ ఉంటుంది మొత్తం కోర్స్ అయిన తర్వాత త్రీ గ్రాండ్ టెస్ట్ కండక్ట్ చేయడం జరిగింది డౌట్ లీనింగ్ సెషన్స్ ఉంటాయి ఇంపార్టెంట్ నోట్స్ అండ్ మైండ్ మ్యాప్స్ ఫర్ ఆల్ ది సిక్స్ చాప్టర్స్ అంటే మొత్తం నైన్ హండ్రెడ్ రూపీస్కి అవైలబుల్గా ఉంది ఎవరైతే ఇంట్రెస్టెడ్ స్టూడెంట్స్ ఉంటారో వాళ్ళకి ఈ మనీ అనేది ఎక్కువగా అనిపిస్తే కనుక ఇఫ్ యూ సెండ్ ద మెసేజ్ ఐ విల్ గివ్ యూ ద కూపన్ కోడ్ ఓన్లీ ఫర్ ద స్టూడెంట్ ఎందుకంటే ప్రీవియస్గా కూడా ఇది ఫైవ్ హండ్రెడ్ రూపీస్కి అవైలబుల్గా ఉంది మళ్ళీ ఎందుకు స్పెషల్గా వాళ్ళకి ఎక్కువ ప్రైస్ పెట్టడం అని చెప్పేసి I'll give you the coupon code. Okay. okay, okay. No problem. Now come to the 23rd. The right answer is fourth option. All the above. And uh, for 23, not bare rock only. Reservoir and newly cool lava. All of the above. 24th question. yes very good 24th question the right answer is uh, you can read this and uh, dharani is now screen is clear now yes kokati why not first option for the question number 22 nenu meeku show chestan ganeshwari 22 question number and 24 the right answer is one very good chandrika 25134 very good phytoplankton and uh, submerged free everything so here is the 25 and 26 100 tests unna mana app lo ee 100 tests ki sorry 70 plus tests unna 100 rupees ki available ga undi ante prathi test lo less than 2 rupees anamata 70 plus tests 72 or 73 unte అండ్ ప్రతి టెస్ట్ చాలా ఛాలెంజింగ్ క్వశ్చన్స్తో ప్రిపేర్ చేయడం జరిగింది ఇలాంటి స్టేట్మెంట్ టైప్ క్వశ్చన్స్లో అందులో రెండు గ్రాండ్ టెస్ట్లు ఉంటాయి ఒకటేమో టూ థౌజండ్ ట్వంటీ టూ నీట్ ఎగ్జామినేషన్ పేపర్ మొత్తం టూ హండ్రెడ్ క్వశ్చన్స్తో ఉంటుంది ఫిజిక్స్ కెమిస్ట్రీ బాటనీ జువాలజీ ప్రతి క్వశ్చన్ నుంచి ఫి ప్రతి సబ్జెక్ట్ నుంచి ఫిఫ్టీ క్వశ్చన్స్ అండ్ ఆ ఫిఫ్టీలో కూడా థర్టీ ఫైవ్ ఏమో సెక్షన్ ఏగా ఫిఫ్టీన్ ఏమో సెక్షన్ బీగా డివైడ్ అయ్యి ఉంటుంది టోటల్ టూ హండ్రెడ్ క్వశ్చన్స్ ఒక పేపర్ అలాంటిది టూ థౌజండ్ ట్వంటీ త్రీ అంటే మీరు రాయబోయే ఎగ్జామ్ని మేము గెస్ట్ చేసి పెట్టిన ఎగ్జామ్ ఉంటుంది అది కూడా టూ హండ్రెడ్ క్వశ్చన్స్ ఉంటాయి ఫిజిక్స్ కెమిస్ట్రీ బాటనీ జువాలజీ ఎక్స్పర్ట్స్ అందరూ ప్రిపేర్ చేసిన పేపర్ అది సో గెస్టింగ్ పేపర్ అంటున్నాం దీన్ని అండ్ ఛాలెంజింగ్ గ్రాండ్ టెస్ట్స్ ఉంటాయి అండ్ క్యూములేటివ్ టెస్ట్స్ ఉంటాయి చాప్టర్ వైజ్ టాపిక్ వైజ్ టెస్ట్స్ ఉంటాయి ఇలాంటివి సెవెంటీ ప్లస్ టెస్ట్స్ ఆన్లైన్ టెస్ట్లు ఉన్నాయి ఇవన్నీ కలిపి ఓన్లీ హండ్రెడ్ రూపీస్కి అవైలబుల్గా ఉంటుంది యూ క్యాన్ అటెంప్ దిస్ టెస్ట్ కమ్ టు ద ట్వంటీ ఫిఫ్త్ క్వశ్చన్ ద రైట్ ఆన్సర్ ఇస్ త్రీ వెరీ గుడ్ వెరీ గుడ్ చిన్ను కమ్ టు ద ట్వంటీ సిక్స్త్ Uh, the right answer is actually the 1987 1987 amended in which year of included the noise as an air pollutant and come to the 27th question try to uh, read and solve this so for gnaneshwar i am going to show you the question number 22 right okay an overwhelming majority of animals and nearly all plants cannot maintain a constant internal environment their body temperature changes with the ambient temperature they are called conformers okay so what is the question actually for the 22 an overwhelming majority of animals and nearly all plants maintain a constant internal environment that is correct desert plants develop cam pathway to avoid the water loss it enable their stomata to remain close during the daytime statement 2 
and overwhelming majority of animals and nearly all plants maintain a constant internal temperature. What they are saying? Cannot maintain a constant internal environment. They, they said they maintain. In our also there is uh, no maintenance of uh, constant internal body temperature, right? 27th question. Clear Jnaneshwari now? We and the birds, that means mammals and birds only can maintain the constant internal body temperature. The plants and animals like fishes, amphibians, they cannot maintain the internal body temperature constantly. Yes. Very good. Come to the 27th question. The right answer for the 27th question is correct statement about the protest. Slime moles, flagellated protozoans, protozoans, euglenoids. Anybody say the right answer for the 27th question? And don't forget to like the session. 27th the right answer is protozoans. Because the single like and a single share is enough for me. Twenty-eighth question, which is not a significance of mitosis. Which is not a significance of mitosis. Twenty-eighth question. Twenty seven explanation cover, okay. Correct statement about the protest. Here, slime molds under suitable conditions form an uh, aggregation called plasmodium, which may grow under speed over several feet under unfavorable conditions. They form fruiting bodies bearing spores at their tips. Okay. Flagellated protozoans are either free living or parasitic euglenoids have a protein rich layer called pellicle which makes their body flexible. Okay. And uh, that one only. That is only the they give the answer. Here it is the clear. Come to the 28th. Yes, very good. 28th question, the right answer is not 4 Chandrika, it is uh, 1. Which is not significance of mitosis. It helps in uh, conservation of specific chromosome number of each species. It is not a significance of mitosis. Yes, sir. come to the 29th question. Aunu darne deni ki auna no much pain hai. Gnaneshwari says 3. Tiropsida. Heterosporous selaginella belongs to which class of pteridophyta? Selaginella, heterosporous selaginella. Actually, it is uh, silopsida, not for tiropsida. Now, here the question number 30, and I'm going to show you a video about the free test. If you have downloaded this in the left upper corner, you have a three bar button. If you click on the three bar button, you have a side menu open in that fourth option. Fourth option is free test. If free test is three parts, you have ongoing, upcoming, and already attempted. So, ongoing, you have choose more than 20 plus tests. Okay, first download this. If you attempt the test, there is a uh, four options for every one question and pretty question four marks and one negative mark and uh, pine time run out on the 
టైం పక్కన ఒక చిన్న ఐ బటన్ ఉంటుంది ఐ బటన్ అది ఒక రివ్యూ కోసం అంటే మీరు మీ టైంని వేస్ట్ చేసుకోకూడదు ఏదైనా క్వశ్చన్ దగ్గర ఎగ్జామ్ అటెండ్ చేసేటప్పుడు అని అనుకుంటే కనుక యూ కెన్ సింప్లీ క్లిక్ ఆన్ దట్ రివ్యూ బటన్ మీరు ఎగ్జామ్ సబ్మిట్ చేసేటప్పుడు ఎన్ని క్వశ్చన్స్ అటెండ్ చేశారు ఎన్ని క్వశ్చన్స్ లెఫ్ట్ అయ్యాయి ఎన్ని క్వశ్చన్స్ రివ్యూ కోసం సెలెక్ట్ చేసుకున్నారు ప్రతిదీది చూపిస్తుంది అండ్ మీరు పర్పుల్ కలర్ బటన్ మీరు క్లిక్ చేసిన వెంటనే ఆటోమేటిక్గా మిమ్మల్ని అది ఆ రెస్పెక్టెడ్ క్వశ్చన్కి తీసుకెళ్తుంది అండ్ వెన్ యూ సబ్మిట్ ద ఎగ్జామినేషన్ ఇమీడియట్లీ ఇట్ క్యాలకులేట్ అవర్ స్కోర్ అండ్ ఇట్ జస్ట్ కంపేర్ విత్ ద ప్రీవియస్ స్టూడెంట్ స్కోర్ ఆల్సో అండ్ ఇట్ గివ్ యూ ద ర్యాంక్ అండ్ యువర్ మార్క్స్ అండ్ హౌ మచ్ టైమ్ యూ టేక్ టు కంప్లీట్ ద టెస్ట్ విచ్ టైప్ ఆఫ్ క్వశ్చన్స్ యూ అటెంప్టెడ్ ఏదర్ మీడియం క్వశ్చన్స్ ఆర్ ఈజీ క్వశ్చన్స్ ఆర్ డిఫికల్ట్ క్వశ్చన్స్ అలాంగ్ విత్ ద సొల్యూషన్స్ ఇట్ ఈస్ రియల్ అమేజింగ్ ఎక్స్పీరియన్స్ ఒక్కసారి డౌన్లోడ్ చేసి యాప్ని అందులో మీరు ఫ్రీ టెస్ట్ అటెంప్ట్ చేయండి అండ్ మీరు ఖచ్చితంగా ఈ నెవర్ ఫీల్ రిగ్రేట్ నా కమ్ టు ద క్వశ్చన్ నెంబర్ థర్టీ ద థర్టీ ఎత్ రైట్ ఆన్సర్ ఈజ్ నో ఎవ్రీబడీ సేస్ త్రీ ఫ్లోరల్ ఫార్ములా ఆఫ్ క్యాలీఫ్లవర్ ఈజ్ యాక్చువల్లీ ద ఆప్షన్ ఫోర్ ఓకే ఎనీ హౌ థ్యాంక్ యూ ఫర్ వాచింగ్ ద వీడియో నా కమ్ టు ద క్వశ్చన్ నెంబర్ థర్టీ వన్ ఇన్ ఎన్సిఆర్టి సెలాజినెల్లా బిలాంగ్స్ టు ద లైక్ ఆఫ్ సిడా ఓకే సో స్వరూప థ్యాంక్ యూ ఫర్ దిస్ ఇన్ఫర్మేషన్ క్వశ్చన్ నెంబర్ చెప్తావు ఒకసారి ఏ క్వశ్చన్లో మనం ఈ సెలాజనల్లా కోసం డిస్కస్ చేసాం దానికి సంబంధించిన ఈ పీడిఎఫ్ ఎక్స్ప్లెనేషన్ నేను మీకు షో చేస్తాను కమ్ టు ద థర్టీ ఫస్ట్ క్వశ్చన్ నెంబర్ థర్టీ వన్ ట్వంటీ నైన్ ఫోర్ ఓన్లీ ట్వంటీ ఎయిట్ వన్ ఓన్లీ సెలాజినెల్లా ఓకే ట్వంటీ నైన్త్ క్వశ్చన్ సో సెలాజినెల్లా బిలాంగ్స్ టు విచ్ క్లాస్ ఆఫ్ టెరిడోఫైటా లైక్ ఆఫ్ సిడా ఈజ్ క్లాస్ ఓన్లీ రైట్ ఓకే ఐ విల్ షో యూ ద సెలాజినెల్లా ట్వంటీ నైన్త్ క్వశ్చన్ Selaginella is belongs to the genus vascular plants pteridophytes. It belongs to the Lycopsida having the heterospores. 29th one. Okay, sorry for the wrong option. 29th one only. I saw uh, written in a wrong manner. Okay, very good. Very good, uh, Swarupa. You are right. Selaginella. like opsida thank you so much so meeku edaina oka doubt ochinappudu meena akala chepthe nenu kachithanga oka sari nenu recheck chestanu oka adavad lo nenu prepare chesina key okokka sari mistake undochu question number 31 yes yes 31 so question number 31 i think you already know this answer 31 ala birds and plants protect themselves by the presence of bud scales folded leaves and hair all of these 32 yes nanashwari right come to the 32 valvate imbricate twisted baxillary cotton cassia bean and kelotropis 32 థర్టీ వన్ ఫోర్ ఓకే ధరణి థర్టీ టూ చిన్ను రైట్ థర్టీ టూ జ్ఞానేశ్వరి సేస్ వన్ యా ధరణి రైట్ ఫోర్ టూ వన్ త్రీ ఎస్టివేషన్ అండ్ ఎగ్జాంపుల్స్ వాల్వేట్ ఎస్టివేషన్ కెలోట్రోపిస్ ఇంబిరికేట్ ఎస్టివేషన్ కేసియా and uh, twisted estivation cotton and vaxillary estivation in beans come to the 33 question number 33 bumper bonanza most of the questions are present here very important 33 34 35 36 yeah babu welcome
Yes, Swarup, I'm already showing you that 29th explanation. I think maybe you are stuck at that bit only. Uh, click on your screen, right side of your screen for several times, then you will reach the current question. We are at the question number 36 now. Of course, in the same question, we give uh, different. Yeah, Gnaneshwar, you were right. 36, option 1, PS1, Pony and Selvan 1. No? NADPH is generated through the PS1. And uh, come to the 33, 34, 35. Thirty six, not four. It is one. Okay, I'll uh, give you the answer for the thirty three question. Yes, right, Nyaneshwari. Copper. Very small amounts. Copper is uh, required. Very small amounts. Thirty four. At uh, incipient plasmolysis, water potential is equal to the thirty four. Um, Lakshmi, welcome Lakshmi and uh, Gnaneshwari Lakshmi says the same option that is uh, Psi S plus Psi P but the 34 the right answer is actually only the Psi S. 35 in anaerobic respiration glycolysis also generate NADPH in anaerobic respiration. Okay but uh, PS2 if you have the question, I will uh, try to show the that explanation for that question. 35. Yes. No, Gnaneshwari. Both statements are correct. Now come to the 36th question. Uh, for Chinnu. Here it is the 37th question. Try to observe the 37th question diagram. And uh, yes, I will show, show that uh, question number. Explanation for that 36th question explanation. I'll show and try to observe the question number 37 and the diagram. Okay, what is this A, B, and C? Thirty-six, right? Photo system one only not in uh, any other so now come to this here a is ribulose 15 bisphosphate and um, b is 3 phosphoglycerate and c is triose phosphate option 2 is the right answer for the 37 okay now come to Yes, Nyaneshwari. Chinnu, right? So, if you are not satisfied with that answer, with that explanation, you can uh, send me the question uh, screenshot to my personal message. I'll show that to my colleague and uh, he will explain. I'll record that and I'll uh, send that to you. Okay. So, you will be clear about that. 38th question. So, I will tell you that there is a bit of doubt. The explanation में मन नहीं sides पे चेयर कोई नहीं लेते इधर बहुत नहीं का अब टा क्वेश्चन में ना स्क्रीनशॉट तीस पंपिस थे ने नो within twenty four hours लो the explanation तीस कुनी मेक मन ने रिपोर्ट चेस में doubt clarify जास करनो you should not slept with a doubt in your mind वो का doubt तो मात्र मेरे निद्रा पावत दो अधे clarify इन दरवाते मेरे पार कुदर गयी come to thirty eighth question thirty seven to right 38th question Yes, Lakshmi, very good The right answer is 1 When PGAL is converted into BPGA 39th question, Lakshmi Yeah, Veeranna Veeranna ji, welcome and uh, wherein now you are stuck at the 35th question so please click on your screen right side of your screen for several times then you will reach the current question we are at the question number 40 screen enlarge chayala
थर्टी नाइन्थ क्वेश्चन ऑक्सीडेशन ऑफ थ्री मॉलिक्यूल्स ऑफ एफ एडी हेच टू विल प्रोड्यूस हाउ मेनी एटीबी मॉलिक्यूल्स थर्टी नाइन टू वेरी गुड धरणी एंड चिन्नू वेरी गुड एंड कम टू द फोर्टी एथ क्वेश्चन विच आर द फॉलोइंग इज नॉट फिजियोलॉजिकल इफेक्ट ऑफ ऑक्सीजन थर्टी नाइन टू ओनली एंड फोर्टी एथ क्वेश्चन Yeah, fourteenth question. The right answer is they causes the fruits to elongate and improve its shape. Fourteenth is the fourth option is the right answer. Chino. Now come to the forty-one question number. I think for question number forty-one there is no need of enlargement of the screen. Okay. What will happen if cytokinin is not being added in a culture medium? so that means when i when i keep more than two questions or more than one question in one slide my inner uh, feeling is you can attempt at least uh, any one of the two questions from the same slide and it will be uh, completed within a few minutes yeah then you can uh, prepare on your own like that i don't want to waste your time but i just want to revise your topics your knowledge question number 41 The right answer is two. Process of cell division, differentiation, and growth will become slow. Very good, Nyaneshwari. Forty-two. Which of the following hormone is not found in plants? Which of the following hormone is not found in plants? Forty-two and forty-three. Try to solve these two. Forty-two. The right answer is. okay nyaneshwari says iba it is present the naa is absent 424 is the right answer come to the 43 yes lakshmi you are right where and not 38 you are talked come to the 43 the right answer is 3 Bacteria, PPLO, viruses, and viroids. Okay, right. Now come to the forty-four. Nucleus is the site of synthesis of which of the following molecule? Forty-three. Right, Swarupa and uh, Dharani and Janeshwari, Chinnu. Divya Sri, okay. So you are Divya Sri. Tell me Divya Sri. Question number forty-four. Divya Sri from then who is Lakshmi? Yes, the forty-four. The right answer is you say sir two. But yes, the Chinu, you are right. R R N Y, forty four is one. The right answer is forty four one. Come to the forty five and forty six. Okay, okay, right. Tell me the yes, the question number forty five. Which cell organelle is associated with the secretory activity of cell? Which cell organelle? The yes, the you are from village. AP or Telangana or any other state. Forty-five. Yes, Ganeshwari. Uh, it is not uh, lysosomes. Actually, it is the Golgi body. Which cell are they associated with? The secretory activity of the cell. Golgi bodies. They are associated with the secretory. Okay, forty-five two. And forty-six. Yes, Chinnu right. Forty-six. Nuclear envelope develops around the chromosome cluster at each pole, forming two daughter nuclei during. Guntur, okay. Chinnu says synthesis. Synthesis and secrete. They are packing. Okay. Forty-six. 
escape. So come to the 46th question. The right answer is actually the telophase, not late metaphase. They all are around the chromosome cluster at each pole forming two daughter nuclei is in the telophase. So the right answer for the 46 is 4 and 45 is 2 and 44 is 1. Okay, now come to the 47th question. Explanation for 45 question number. Definitely, definitely, uh, Chinu, I'll show. So before that, try to observe this question number 47 and 48. I'm going to show you the explanation for the 46th question. Why it is a telophase only, right? I think I am also thinking like telophase only the right answer. Forty-six nuclear envelope, endoplasmic reticulum, Golgi body, all reform at telophase stage. Nuclear envelope, endoplasmic reticulum, Golgi bodies, all are reform at telophase stage. Nuclear envelope develops around the chromosome clusters at each pole forming two daughter nuclei in telophase stage only like this. Nuclear membrane is formed in telophase. I think you are satisfied with this explanation Chinnu. Right? Yeah, Swarupa says the answer for the 47th question. 45. Golgi body is associated with the secretory activity of the cell. It helps in transporting protein with the, within or outside the cell. Okay, now come back to the 47th question. As uh, Swarupa says, uh, 47th uh, 2. Most, most like uh, funeria is amphibious in nature. Okay, Moses possesses vascular tissues. They need moisture for fertilization. Is Moses require Moses require moisture for the fertilization? 47th. Think of 47th. The right answer is uh, assertion is correct, but the reason is false. Sorupa, if you uh, have any doubt, please let me know. I'll try to show the explanation because uh, your guessings are not uh, wrong most of the times. Come to the 48th question. The synapsis of homologous chromosomes begins in which stage of the cell division? Yes, very good, Nyaneshwari. You are right. Diplotin. Now, last but not least, our favorite most important question. Question number 49 and 50 both are present on the same slide. And uh, here I will show. The question number 49 first in a magnifier manner. Assertion Entry of water from soil into the xylem takes place through gradient of suction pressure. Reason Water moves from a place of higher suction pressure to the place of lower suction pressure. Water moves from a place of higher suction pressure to the low place of lower suction pressure. Is that right? 49th. So, I think 49th. Assertion may be right, but reason is false. Definitely, it is a move from a lower suction pressure to the higher suction pressure. Yes, Gnaneshwari, you are right. 49th. Now come to the question number 50, our favorite question. The students who are giving the answer for the last question, 50th question. They will definitely get the good marks in the next NEET examination, MSET or final examinations. Even though your answer is right or wrong for this question, you will definitely get the good marks. Question number 50 on 49. And a small clue for this, for both 49 and 50, option is same number. For this, the right answer is 3. Assertion is true, but reason is false. 
धरणी बेरना चिन्हूसेन वन मेग्नीशियम प्लस फास्पोना पैरवेट कॉर्बोक्सी सलफर फेरोडाक्सी Actually, it is the incorrect match for the question number fifty. Yes, the Divya Dharani Ganeshpuri, very good, well done. And I will try to show the question number fifty at the explanation also, last question explanation also, if it is there. Right. Molybdenum is a component of enzyme nitrogenase. Okay, so molybdenum. Not the uh, that option. What we choose? Okay, manganese is not correct. It is a molybdenum. And the come to the remaining. Magnesium is an activator for both RUBP carboxylase oxygenase and phosphoenal pyruvate carboxylase enzymes. Zinc is an activator of enzyme alcohol dehydrogenase. Sulfurs is a constituent of the ferredoxin. So all are correct matches except the option three. so this is about today's session thank you so much for all the students who are attended and make this session successful don't forget to give the like button and thank you divya dharani gyaneshwari veeranna chinnu and um, swarupa yes uh, uh, the babu every student thank you so much name wise and uh, we will meet tomorrow at the same time evening 7 o'clock the live session 34th live session topic is zoology maximum grand test on zoology okay try to download our app rajesh biology and don't forget to like the session your like and share is more than enough for my efforts thank you have a nice day good night